Can artificial intelligence actually protect crops and secure our global food supply? Yes, it can, and that's exactly what the AI-based crop disease detection system is designed to do. This project uses computer vision to analyze leaf images, identify early signs of disease, and alert farmers before serious damage occurs. It's like giving every farmer a digital plant doctor in their pocket. Why does this matter right now? Because between 2025 and 2027, the agricultural sector is undergoing one of the biggest tech revolutions in history. Climate change, unpredictable weather, and food security challenges are forcing farms to adopt precision agriculture powered by AI. Governments and investors are pouring funds into agritech, and this is where your skills as an AI student can make a real difference. Just learning a model here, you're learning to build systems that directly impact lives, improve sustainability, and reduce global hunger. This is where artificial intelligence meets purpose, and it's one of the most rewarding domains to build your career in. Let's explore where the AI-based crop disease detection system is used in the real world. In commercial agriculture, large-scale farms deploy mobile applications that instantly diagnose plant diseases across thousands of acres. Research institutions and agricultural universities rely on similar systems to track disease patterns and breed new, more resilient plant varieties. Go integration is another breakthrough. AI-powered drones can scan entire fields, detect subtle signs of infection, and even generate health maps to guide field treatments. Each of these applications showcases how AI is redefining agriculture, turning data into action. The demand for such solutions is exploding, with agritech startups, food production companies, and drone technology firms actively hiring talent in AI and computer vision. As a student or fresher, this project gives you exposure to real-world data, system design, and deployment challenges, all skills that make your portfolio stand out. You're not just learning technology here, you're learning how to apply it to feed the world more intelligently. Now let's talk about the skills that will make you job-ready through this project. You'll start with computer vision fundamentals like image classification and object detection using libraries such as OpenCV and SkySync Image in Python. Then you'll dive into deep learning, applying CNN architectures like ResNet, EfficientNet, and Vision Transformers to train your model. Transfer learning helps you fine-tune existing networks for agricultural data, making your training efficient even with limited resources. For deployment, TensorFlow Lite or ONX lets you optimize models for mobile or edge devices. Alongside technical expertise, you'll also build essential soft skills, understanding plant pathology, assessing data quality, and communicating insights to non-technical agricultural stakeholders. Tools like PyTorch, TensorFlow, RoboFlow, and Streamlit make it easy to manage datasets, build models, and create user interfaces. These combined skills, technical and domain-specific, are exactly what recruiters look for in computer vision engineers and AI specialists. This project gives you that perfect skill balance. Here's your step-by-step -step roadmap to build the AI-based crop disease detection system. You begin with dataset acquisition, using the Plant Village dataset of over 54,000 images and 38 disease classes, or by collecting your own regional crop data. Next, in pre-processing, you'll clean and enhance images through rotation, color jitter, and segmentation. Then comes model development, training CNNs like EfficientNet or ResNet using transfer learning to recognize disease patterns accurately. Once your model performs well, validate it with field images to achieve at least 95% accuracy. Finally, deploy it to a mobile or web app using TensorFlow Lite or Flask so it can analyze live camera feeds in real time. For beginners, this journey takes about six to eight weeks. Intermediate students can complete it in three to four. Along the way, you'll master the end-to-end -end life cycle of an AI product, from data to deployment. You'll not only gain experience, but create something truly impactful. Start building this today and put it on GitHub. Now let's talk about the real-world career impact of this project. Completing an AI-based crop disease detection system proves to recruiters that you can solve complex problems using image data, deep learning, and mobile deployment, skills that translate to dozens of high-value roles. You can target roles like computer vision engineer, agritech AI specialist, machine learning engineer in agriculture, or even applied AI scientist. 
Recruiters expect hands-on experience in model development, edge deployment, and achieving measurable accuracy metrics, all of which this project provides. On your resume, keywords like CNN, TensorFlow Lite, transfer learning, and agricultural AI will stand out instantly. Companies such as Kroppen, Dehot, Agrostar, Farm ERP, Jiva Agriculture, and IBM Food Trust actively hire engineers in this space. Freshers in India can expect salaries between 6 and 12 LPA, while experienced professionals earn up to 25 LPA or more. Globally, this field ranges from $75 to $140,000. Remember, this isn't just a resume project, it's a gateway to a meaningful AI career that impacts global food systems. Start building this today and put it on GitHub.